Welcome, Patriot. Welcome back to The Big Show, the weekly fun and entertainment show from Studio B at Patriot High School. It's time to get started. Throughout the year, the Ask Patriot squad will be looking for answers to a whole bunch of questions. Don't be shy. This is a chance to share your thoughts, likes, and ideas on a variety of topics. We look forward to seeing you on the show. We wondered who your favorite music artist was, so we asked. There you go. Um, my favorite artist is 21 Savage. My favorite artist is Paul. My favorite music artist is Hannah Montana. Drake. J. Cole. Yeah, Future. J. Cole. <laughs> Drake. Okay, my favorite music artist would probably be Coldplay. It's Ariel Camachandra. My favorite music artist is Michael Jackson. I like Megan Trainor because she's a really good influence. Um, I like Bryson Tiller. My favorite music artist is Little Uzi Vert. Morrissey. With the weekend coming, we try and find some cool movies for you. Take a look. Hey Patriot, are you looking for a movie to watch this weekend? You need to check out Kubo. On the two streams, this movie is rated PG. Young Kubo's peaceful existence comes crashing down when he accidentally summons a vengeful spirit from the past. Now on the run, Kubo joins forces with Monkey and Beetle to a legacy or legacy. Armed with a magical instrument, Kubo must battle the king and other gods and monsters to save his family and solve an issue with his fallen father. What do you do on the weekends? Here's what Cole does. Good old days. We find things that do that for you. Hey guys, I'm Miguel. And I'm Rachel. Welcome to the second week of Nostalgia. This week we are taking you back to some of our favorite TV shows. We're starting with Foster's Home for Imaginary Friends. <laughs> cartoon about Mac and his imaginary friend Blue. Blue was sent to the home because Mac's mother thought that he was too old to keep Blue. Next up, Invader Zim. Invader Zim is vanished from his home planet Earth. After pretty much destroying the planet, his superiors give him another chance by vanishing to Earth. <laughs> Dexter's Laboratory is about a genius young boy who hides a secret lab inside his house from his parents. His older sister, Dee Dee, also knows about this and continues to go inside and interfere with Dexter's experiment. Studio B likes music. Each week, we bring you information on what's new and what's going on in the music scene. Hey guys, welcome back to Music News. Most music artists change their name when they become popular, like Bruno Mars or Sia. Actually, contrary to some people's beliefs, Sia's real first name is Sia. Wow, and right now Sia's on Cheap Girls is the number one on the Hot 100. The throwback song for this week is Ignition by R. Kelly. His first name is Robert. He quit professional basketball to become a singer. You got me playing the field, so baby, give me that. And let me get that. Running her hands through my fro. Bouncing on 24. Why they say I'm ready? It's the remix to Ignition. Hot and fresh out the kitchen. So, everyone knows Beyonce, right? Mostly. Well, I bet only her true fans know that she was the first female to win six Grammys in one night. Impressive. Do you ever have one of those say what moments? We found some we can share. Hey Patriot, welcome back to Say What? So, do you remember as a kid your mom would always tell you not to stick your fingers into the fishbowl? Yeah, well, this time did other plans.
That's all for this week. See you next week with Say What? what? That's our show for today. Get out there and have some fun this weekend. Be sure to tune in Monday for what you need to know.